Bulgaria is one of the initial targets in Russian strike. Poland prepares citizens for war with Russia. The Bulgarian right-wing party Revival has issued a stark warning suggesting Bulgaria could become one of the initial targets in a potential Russian military strike, according to Novinite media outlet. Consequently, the party argues for Bulgaria's withdrawal from NATO. Soncho Ganev, speaking on behalf of the Revival Parliamentary Group, asserted that NATO is not merely a defensive bloc, but is actively involved in a military campaign against Russia in Ukraine. Ganev called for a national referendum to decide Bulgaria's NATO membership status. Ganev emphasized his belief that the war in Ukraine is nearing its conclusion, with Ukraine losing ground and a Russian victory imminent. He highlighted the presence of a NATO command center in Varna for over four years as a reason why Bulgaria could be targeted by Russia. In his address to Parliament, Ganev urged acting Prime Minister Dimitar Glavchev to provide clarity on Bulgaria's stance, which will be presented at the upcoming NATO summit in Washington next month. While foreign policy decisions rest with the Council of Ministers as a parliamentary republic, we have the right to know Bulgaria's position. Ganev remarked, stressing the need for transparency in Bulgaria's foreign policy ahead of the NATO summit. Poland has seen what has happened to its Ukrainian neighbor since Russia's full-scale invasion and doesn't intend to be caught unprepared as Kyiv was. Even before Russia's war of aggression against Ukraine began in February 2022, Poland had decided to modernize and rearm its armed forces, but that process really took off because of the invasion, with Warsaw declaring it wanted to create the largest, best-equipped armed forces in Europe by 2035. Colonel Pavel Galaska, commander of the 18th Lomza Logistics Regiment, a unit training, the volunteers said. The army wants to train as many citizens as possible. Everyone knows about the threat that comes from the east. He said at the end of the training, the successful volunteers will take a soldier's oath in which they swear to serve loyally the Republic of Poland even at the cost of losing their life or blood. Russia warns NATO of direct confrontation in the Black Sea due to US drones. Russian Defense Minister Andriy Belosov has instructed his military to consider and propose how to respond to U.S. drones conducting reconnaissance over the Black Sea and indicating targets for the armed forces of Ukraine. The report indicates that Russian military officials are concerned about the increased intensity of U.S. strategic drone flights over the Black Sea where the Russian fleet is located. The Russian Defense Ministry complains that the drones are conducting reconnaissance and indicating targets for the Ukrainians' high-precision weapons to strike Russian military facilities. It shows an increased involvement of the U.S. and other NATO countries in the conflict in Ukraine on the side of the Kyiv regime, the ministry said in a statement. It noted that such flights significantly increase the probability of incidents involving Russian military aircraft, which increases the risk of direct confrontation between the alliance and the Russian Federation. The ministry also hinted that the flights of American drones supposedly increase the likelihood of incidents in the airspace with aircraft of the Russian Aerospace Forces, and this raises the risk of confrontation between the Alliance and the Russian Federation. NATO members will bear responsibility for that, it added. The Black Sea has emerged as a key theater in the ongoing conflict between Russia and Ukraine, with Kyiv reporting significant successes in targeting Russian naval forces in the area. Washington and Moscow have clashed before over US drones in the Black Sea. 
In a 2023 incident, a Russian fighter jet damaged an American drone there, causing it to crash. A repeat of such a confrontation could further fuel tensions over the war in Ukraine. On March the 14th, 2023, an Su-27 fighter jet of the Russian Air Force intercepted and damaged a US MQ-9 Reaper drone, causing it to crash into the Black Sea. The incident marked the first direct clash between the Russian and US forces since the Cold War.